Okay, so this test is a test of your speed. Again, you will remember that as one of our physical fitness components. We looked at that way back in September. We've measured out at five meter intervals all the way down to the double red cones. That is a 35 meter distance. So it's unlikely that you can do this test at home. You might if you're able to measure out that sort of distance somewhere in the park. Um, other than that, we'll do it the next time we meet. So 35 meters, you should do it five times with 30 second recovery between times. It's actually a test of fatigue and how your speed deteriorates over time. So a footballer sprints down the line, gets on the end of a long pass, and it'll be a few seconds before they can repeat that skill in the same amount of time. So we're gonna see how Miss Mann goes. Remember Miss Mann, uh, for those of you that don't know, plays American football. So she's used to the short, sharp sprints that are involved in that game. So it's a very much a, a specificity test linked to the importance of speed. Okay, so Mr. Black is gonna shout out Mrs. Time. We're probably gonna to try to do it three times for you and you can listen out for how the times vary from sprint one to sprint two to sprint three. And I will shout out to Miss um, how much more recovery time she's got between sets. Okay, um, Mr. Black, you're gonna start and stop with the drop of a hand. So if Miss doesn't mind watching Sir's hand. Take your mark. Three point start. Go. Maximal intensity, pumping arms, pumping knees, head comes up, decelerate, and then I start to record the 30 second recovery. So Eight we've seconds. already had seven Zero seconds nine. recovery, that's 10 seconds recovery. So if Miss times it right, she'll probably get back to the line in time to go again. Pay particular attention to the start position this time. It's called the three point start. If you had blocks, you might even use those. So we've still got four, three, two, one, go. What was the first one? She's getting faster. We might have to do the five. <laughs> yeah, that's probably not uncommon. Human error as well. Well, that is a factor, sir, and it actually mentions it in the book. The disadvantage of this test is if I say go, and sir's a few, just milliseconds off me saying go. Okay, in three, two, one, go. Do you want one more? Yeah. 10 seconds recovery. From the book, you guys will know that these are hollow sprints that Miss is performing. And three, two, one, go. That was an excellent demonstration from Miss, I'm sure you'll agree. Um, again, in the lesson when we get to meet each other next, I'll give you guys a chance to experience that. Um, you should do it over five attempts and then you would compare your your fastest time, not, not necessarily your first time, um, to your last time and to see how you are affected by fatigue over a 35 meter sprint.